అందరికీ నమస్కారం ఎస్బీఆర్ టాక్ ఛానల్ స్వాగతం ఛానల్ వెంటనే సబ్స్క్రైబ్ చేసుకోండి అదేవిధంగా ప్లే స్టోర్ నుంచి అతి ముఖ్యమైనటువంటి యాప్ ఎస్బీఆర్ టాక్స్ డౌన్లోడ్ చేసుకోండి ఎస్బీఆర్ టాక్స్ యూట్యూబ్ ఛానల్తో పాటు ఎస్బీఆర్ టాక్స్ యాప్ పనిచేస్తుంది ఎస్బీఆర్ టాక్స్ యాప్ వల్ల ఇప్పటికే వేలాది మంది ప్రయోజనం పొందారు యూట్యూబ్ ఛానల్ వల్ల లక్షలాది మంది అవగాహనతో సరైన నిర్ణయాలు తీసుకున్నారు కాబట్టి మిత్రులారా ఎస్బీఆర్ టాక్స్ ద్వారా అనేక కార్యక్రమాలు నడుస్తున్నాయి మీ ప్లే స్టోర్ నుంచి డౌన్లోడ్ చేసుకోవచ్చు మీకు స్క్రీన్ మీద కనబడేటువంటి నెంబర్కి ఫోన్ చేస్తే మీకు డౌన్లోడ్లు ఇబ్బంది ఉంటే వాటిని గైడ్ చేస్తారు దీనిలో వారం వారం జూమ్ మీటింగ్ నడుస్తుంది ప్రత్యక్షంగా మాట్లాడే సుమారు గంటన్నర రెండు గంటల సేపు నడుస్తుంది అదేవిధంగా మీకు కాలేజీలు అడ్మిషన్ టెస్ట్లు ఎప్పుడు వాళ్ళ అడ్రస్లు ఏంటి ఫోన్ నెంబర్లు ఏంటి ఫీజ్ స్ట్రక్చర్స్ ఏంటి వాళ్ళు ఇచ్చే స్కాలర్షిప్ ఏంటి కాబట్టి అతి తక్కువ ఫీజుతో కేవలం ఏడాదికి మూడు వందలు ఎలాంటి స్కూల్ కళ ఎంపిక చేసుకునే విషయం మీద దాని మీద వాట్సాప్ గ్రూప్లో ఏర్పాటు చేయబడుతుంది అదేవిధంగా జోసా కౌన్సిలింగ్ జోసా బిడ్సర్ కౌన్సిలింగ్ పదిహేను వందలు అదేవిధంగా ఎంసెట్ వాటికి జస్ట్ ఫైవ్ హండ్రెడ్ దీనిలో అనేక రకాల కార్యక్రమాలు ఓన్లీ సింగిల్ పేమెంట్ కాబట్టి ఈ అవకాశం తప్పనిసరి ఉపయోగించుకోండి ధన్యవాద్ భారత్ మతా కి జై నమస్తే దిక్సూచి కార్యక్రమానికి స్వాగతం ఐఐటి పరీక్షలు అనగానే విద్యార్థులు ఆందోళన చెందుతూ ఉంటారు మంచి మార్కులు సాధించడానికి నిద్రాహారాలు మానేసి రాత్రి పగలు అని తేడా లేకుండా కష్టపడతారు ఐఐటి పరీక్షలో విద్యార్థులు మానసిక ఒత్తిడికి గురి కాకుండా ఎన్హెచ్టీవీ ప్రతిష్టాన్ సంస్థ కలిసి నిర్వహిస్తున్నటువంటి ఈ దిక్సూచి కార్యక్రమంలో భాగంగా ఐఐటి ప్రిపరేషన్ సిరీస్ను మీ ముందుకు తీసుకురావడం జరిగింది ఐఐటిఎన్స్తో నడపబడుతున్నటువంటి మాడ్యులస్ ఎడ్యుకేషనల్ ఇన్స్టిట్యూట్ డైరెక్టర్ నితిన్ కుమార్ ఆయన ఐఐటి ఢిల్లీలో పూర్తి చేయడం జరిగింది ఆయన ప్రస్తుతం మనతో పాటు స్టూడియోలో ఉన్నారు వారిని అడిగి మనం మరిన్ని విషయాలు తెలుసుకుందాం మ్యాథ్స్ ఫిజిక్స్ కెమిస్ట్రీ ఇలా ఏ సబ్జెక్ట్ అయినా కానీ ఓవరాల్గా ఐఐటి ఎంట్రన్స్ ఎగ్జామ్కి ప్రిపేర్ అవుతున్నటువంటి విద్యార్థులు ఎవరికైనా కూడా ఈ ఎపిసోడ్ చాలా వరకు ఉపయోగపడుతుంది అంటే ఎలాంటి టిప్స్ పాటించాలి ఎలాంటి మెథడాలజీని ఫాలో కావాలి టీచర్స్ చెప్పేది ఏ విధంగా అర్థం చేసుకోవాలి ఇందులో వచ్చేటువంటి ఈ ప్రాసెస్లో ఎదురయ్యేటువంటి ఒత్తిడిని ఏ విధంగా అధిగమించాలి ఈ విషయాలన్నిటి గురించి కూడా మూడు వందల అరవై డిగ్రీల కోణంలో నితిన్ కుమార్ గారు మాట్లాడతారు వెల్కమ్ నితిన్ గారు సో లెట్స్ టాక్ లెట్స్ స్టార్ట్ టుడేస్ ప్రోగ్రామ్ థ్యాంక్ యూ రాజు గారు ఫస్ట్ ఆఫ్ ఆల్ థ్యాంక్ యూ అగైన్ ఫర్ మై ఇన్విటేషన్ ఐఎమ్ వెరీ హ్యాపీ టు కమ్ హియర్ సో లెట్ ఎస్ స్టార్ట్ యా సో ఈజ్ ఇట్ మ్యాండేటరీ ఫర్ అన్ ఎంపీసీ స్టూడెంట్ you know uh, to prepare je mains or je advance are any options okay so like first of all the answer to the question is no okay. it is not mandatory for any mpsc student to prepare for je mains or je advance but i'll just want to speak uh, in detail about this please like uh, see like student will be uh, mpsc student in class 11th and 12th he must have some purpose in life like what he wanted to achieve so it should not be forceful preparation for je mains and advance but as we know student is like not mature enough at that age correct so he should be counseled properly and given the right to decide what he wanted to do mm. for ex- let us take a very simple example a student want to prepare for uh, cricket he want to make a career in cricket he, so he wants to become a cricket yeah so what he will try he might be aiming to target uh, to get a selection in indian t- cricket team right he will not be targeting i should want to play just a district level player he, that he will not target maybe his capability is only to become a district uh, level cricket player but he will not target just to become a district level player so same goes for this also suppose after 12 student want to per- pursue a career like they will go for graduation right so where they want to go for graduation which college they want to study so i think they should target the highest level of college maybe they are not able to achieve that they may not able to achieve also but the point here is what should be their target because if they target that they can achieve something better that is very important according to me so like preparation for je mains advance is not mandatory but if suppose a student have no purpose like i just want to do a graduation so then according to me if a student is mbc background student and if he have the available resources with him he should target je mains advance not for the selection not only for the selection but to do something better in the life because even if he don't get the selection he will learn something he it will he will not be like his time will not be wasted now what happened nowadays the success is judged of a student by whether he is able to make into id or not 
बट अकॉर्डिंग टू मी दैट इज नॉट द सक्सेस सक्सेस इज वॉट ही डिड इन दोस्ट दैट टाइम वेन यू वॉज प्रिपेरिंग हैज यू यूज इज टाइम प्रॉपरली एनेबल टू लर्न समथिंग and that learning is never waste as you say you in our ancient time also even our rishis also they will also say learning is never waste and like it he, that learning may not help him to go to iit they but definitely it will help him in his life also to achieve something maybe for some other exams also 100% so according to me it is not about mandatory thing it is about developing that interest in the student and according that is the responsibility of parents and teachers because of the age factor hmm. if a student is of like 30 or 32 year old i think he is mature enough and government of india also gives him the right hmm. once he turn 18 plus hmm. but according to me a student who is like 16 17 or 15 years old proper counseling is required that why he should try for this exam and what he will learn what he will get and still if he is not satisfied i don't want to prepare we should not force him to prepare correct because uh, otherwise start uh, like fooling parents and teachers and we also actually will fool him if he don't want to prepare we should not force him to prepare that is according to me should be done so counseling is very important before but, starting yes but it is not mandatory for anyone to prepare for je advance or je mains but proper counseling given if he really want to do something in he want to educate himself then the ultimate target for mpsc student should be going to that college only yes that is what i feel so counseling is mandatory mandatory not this <laughs> not the preparation okay yes and uh, the another thing is what is the skill set for any student right uh, you know uh, many students come to you and ask correct correct okay uh, what is the skill set a student must have okay now coming to the skill set uh, there are no fixed defined skill set to crack this exam mm -hmm. as you can see there like uh, we'll get exceptions even like if you will see scroll the internet we can get ev every data available we have seen students who got 55 50 60 percentile in 10th percentage in 10th able to make it to iit and we have even we have seen the example who have got who have topped the board exam who are the toppers but still could not make it to iit hmm. so uh, normally what i according to me what i feel there is no fix uh, things required to crack this exam hmm. except that self determination that consistency and perseverance that that is very important so but coming generally at least like uh, if these are also not there it might become difficult for student so mm. i am a math teacher also i teach is maths so what i tell to my every student even in the class also even to parents also suppose if you want me to judge your student like your kid that whether my kid is capable to crack iit or not i'll ask one simple question do you know table still 20 if the student know table still 20 till class 10th according to me he is perfect to learn Uh, or uh, maybe develop his concepts for je advanced learning that is what i feel now coming to other like mpsc chemistry physics also basics of the that subject is very important so till 10th what happens sometime like not everywhere but to the majority of the educational institutes focus is not on concept learning focus is on uh, scoring marks and uh, that marks we can score by by hurting things also because till then student will be exposed to almost all the con all the subjects let it be english mm. uh, social science like physical education all are important actually for student but actually for this je mains and advanced pre exam preparation important is concept learning so student should be focused on concept learning curiosity he should be asking questions to the teacher that uh, why this is possible why that why that is happening so if that that is there in the student mm. then automatically he becomes eligible to crack for this exam developing the skills we will do that is what uh, this we are here for right that is why we are do, we are doing it but if that curiosity is there in the student that learning is there in the student then automatically i according to me is eligible to go for any any competitions not only for je mains or advance mm. okay and many uh, nitin ji many students and parents also have the this doubt okay when should students start preparing for uh, je mains or uh, je advanced okay so coming to this question again uh, it it should not be when it should be it should be when student should is ready so and proper coaching is very important actually according to me hmm. it is not because see student student can pre prepare from class 6th also and student can prepare from class 9th also sooner he prepare there are more chances for him to crack the exam mm -hmm. but there is one fact in this that one twist in that is mm. student should be interested 
whenever he start preparing oh. otherwise that preparation early preparation can become a demerit also how it can become a demerit basically let us say student is preparing from 6th onwards so but he is not uh, interested he is not finding the interest because of lack of teaching methodology or maybe the way of teaching is not good or maybe he is uh, given extra knowledge which is not required at that age so what happens uh, he is very young so if suppose a father or a mother or some relative will say you have to do it he will try to do it right he will try so what happens he become over stressed mm. and by the time he come to class 9th 10th his excitement to crack this exam is gone because he is doing it by force okay. so if he is doing it by force automatically stress that is interest is gone mm. once the interest is gone no matter how good the student is he will start degrading day by day so sometime what happen according to me uh, time is not important but if you ask me this question i'll say readiness so, ah sooner he start there mm. are more chance for him to crack mm. but it does not mean that student if he they start maybe from 9th or 11th can can can't they get they can also get but chances become more but if given proper guidance and proper coaching that is very important otherwise it becomes a negative point also mm. so that is what i would like to say to this question and uh, according to me in that particular field role of parent and teachers or maybe counselors if not teachers is very very important because if the student is shown fake dreams mm. so normally coming to this our indian society what happens uh, why, uh, if suppose you ask any parent why do you want your son to go to iit or why do you want your daughter to go to iit high salary so the first point is high salary <laughs> my student will get a high salary he'll get very good package mm. which is true 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 to some extent but is not applicable to every iitian right and even according to me a student should not go not go to id for salary even if you see now time time will keep changing right things which were there 10 years before hmm. are changing now correct so now if you see idians me being idian even if you see uh, iitian became a teacher right so iit degree is not required to become a teacher but i am following my passion correct so the people who are going to iit should not go with the purpose of getting a good job or it sh- it should be maybe for one or two year for me it should be he should try to create more jobs so that should be his uh, intentions or whatever that should be his motive when somebody who can crack this exam at this you highest level you follow your passion yes so that's follow how- the passion and right now money is in every field it is not only one you tell me money is in farming like money is in business whatever business you do if you do it with interest or if you do with passion if you are dedicated there is like i don't feel according to me if a student is very Uh, interested he can make money by selling bananas also according to me <laughs> right because there are technology in invo- is evolving now Correct. so everything is possible so whatever is my interest okay so if i do it passionately mm. i can earn not only for me but i can help my society to do grow mm. so that should be the motive mm. to go to iit so Correct. but that is missing Correct. because many parents don't know what are the facilities offered in iit Correct. so even my experience Uh, in iits when you go to iits you develop the passion of self learning like uh, you don't need a teacher to learn because you yourself are that much curious mm. and that much resources are available mm. and you become mature with age when you're in iit you'll be like around 18 plus so like your maturity will be more as compared to 16 15 years of age so you will become mature enough and you will maybe because like what happens in class when you're in class 8 9th your dreams also can change right uh, you Excellent. maybe you want to become a farmer when you class 5 you want to become a doctor when class 7 hmm. maybe or you want to become a businessman or maybe again a farmer or a scientist so there is no because the student don't know but when they go to iit or when they go to higher education education they they dream after that very frequently changes that they decide change. something i want to become this in my life after ex- exposing to each and everything hmm. so then that they can they can like try for excellence in that particular field hmm. so that should be the motive for parents like they should tell their students that you should try for excellence hmm. rather than there are so many students because see if for example coming about iit every year i think around 10 lakh student write this exam hmm. in iit there are i think around 21000 seats right now seats are bit increased now okay. around 21000 approximately exact number i don't know okay. if we see we so can competition check. is very high it's very high and uh, like after it there is nit also which are also national uh, level of importance like uh, though i think there are around 31 to 32000 seats in nits so speaking frankly there are like uh, 20 plus 30 around 50 50 to 60000 seats 
in those colleges hmm. there are uh, 10 lakh students preparing for those colleges so do you think every hard worker will get no no right let us so say practically yeah, not possible out of uh, uh, 10 lakh students let us say according to me see uh, it is just a personal experience looking at the competition around the uh, india like around all over india around 3 to 4 lakhs people will prepare honestly 6 lakh people may not prepare honestly true, true. but 3 4 lakhs will prepare honestly they'll get the sufficient uh, resources also they'll get good teaching also but still among them only 60000 will make it to those colleges right so does it mean who could not get to those colleges they are waste that is not correct at all right they are also equally capable but maybe because of luck if we call it luck or whatever or bad luck they could not get so but they can still do so many good things in life so it should not be that fix in the mindset i need to go to only iit according to me what should be fix in the mindset is let me try my best let me give my best to for that exam if i am not able to get it then also it is fine so that is what i feel that is like that is what i feel it should be gone it should be like it should be in that particular way rather than uh, telling go and go go for iit why i should go for iit because you'll get a very good offers mm -hmm. that straight forward answer is like uh, it it gives more stress to the students correct so that is what i would like to say parents are running after iits and nits yes <laughs> uh, actually students should run but <laughs> what is happening parents are running parents after. are running after okay, iits they are forcing huh. sometimes irrespective of their interests they are forcing majority of the parents like yeah, there are some uh, yeah. not all, all not parents. obviously yeah. but majority of the parents are forcing mm. and getting failure Getting adding to more uh, their frustration yeah. Yeah. and parents who are good in parenting and those who know those who are listening to the experts mm. those who know how to uh, like maybe help my kid to go to that level mm. they are only getting success mm. and people i think according to those who are forcing maybe success rate is very less in those students very less, very less. but those who are relaxed and dedicated and hard working and getting good support from the institute where they are studying or efforts which they are doing they are getting success Correct. So that is what something is happening. So what I say to student also, there are ten lakh student, there are sixty thousand seats. Don't think like that. You think there are sixty thousand seat? I just need one seat. Think in that particular way. Mm. Positive. It, it makes you positive, mm. because uh, so what happens uh, right now? There is too much of competition, and if competition is for good cause, it is good. But if it is for uh, depression, it is not good. Mm. Right. So you don't think in ten lakh and sixty thousand seats. You think. Sixty thousand seat. I need only one. One seat. So it's like it make it it make you feel positive. Positive. Even like even other person can also get, and I can also get. Hmm. Maybe you are the last ranker. He is the top ranker. You can also still get because you just need one seat. One seat. So in that way, if they think, automatically positivity will increase. Hmm. If positivity increase, chance of success are more. Or if chance of success are also let us say success also don't come in that particular way. At least learning will not go waste. Correct. That is very important. That attitude is very important. Attitude is important. Correct. According Correct. to me. Yeah. Yeah. And as you said, uh, pressure. Yes. Pressure uh, has become part of every student's life. Not only students. Right. In fact, every one of us. Correct. You know, Correct. Correct. It it is it is become a uh, you know uh, common thing. Correct. Correct. Uh, unfortunately, we have seen mm -hmm. some incidents. Mm -hmm. Some students are committing suicides. Okay. Very yeah. sad. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. so how to tackle this pressure okay how to be positive in that situations okay actually see according to me it's a bit uh, maybe strict statement if a student is committing suicide it is not the fault of student it is the fault of either parent or teacher mm. i will never believe i will never admit that it is a fault of the student so in that particular way support of teacher as well as parents is required Chal very important ha, because yeah. as i told you they are not very mature people mm. and even i can see from my experience mm. the su suicide case or maybe that depression case is not only because of academics it is because of the lack of support at that particular time mm. or maybe the distraction of the kid from the main goal so both the things are equally important because uh, maybe because like i have been into this coaching field i have prepared myself i have seen the mindset of the my colleagues and my who who are preparing with me but could not go to iit and maybe when i was preparing who were not very good in preparation but working very hard so like if we stay in that atmosphere feeling depressed is very common thing common it's very common but we have to overcome but we have to overcome mm. so who will help them to overcome their friends but unluckily unfortunately their friends also of same age group so they may help him in go 
maybe they they may support him to go to further depression <laughs> right so it is the role of actually teacher and parents to support them for example now we are conducting weekly exams right so students all students will not get good marks that is a fact so simply parent will call and ask why you are not getting marks they will not ask uh, what happened is everything going fine with you or like are you able to understand the subject simply the question is why are you not able to score marks first question imagine a student working very hard how he will answer that question right suppose he is working very very hard because i am also one of those student who is working very hard but not getting the result so what answer he will give to parent according to me what he will give uh, daddy uh, i could not get this time i will get next time most of those are the answers mm. because hard work is doing he cannot do more than that next week again he will get less marks then automatically he is a hard worker student so he have some self respect he is not that student who don't want to study he is not a student who is fooling his parents he is the student who is working very very hard so he will not say same dialogue again that i'll work very hard but he is there is no one to talk to is if he start saying i'm feeling uh, sad his parents will not listen let us say so what happened that become the reason for distraction and going into depression correct so that thing we have to avoid because if parent want to go to iit parent want his kid to go to iit mm. then there is no guarantee kid will go to iit we when kid really want to go to iit there might be some chance of going him to iit so that parent should understand if suppose maybe a parent may be financially very very stable parent may be financially very very unstable or maybe a parent might have taken some loans from other places for his kid to study for iit preparation yeah. but it does not mean that his son will get iit so that pressure should not reflect on student correct that is very like that is wrong some parents do that yes and some parents even tell who are very very stable that don't worry son uh, even if you don't get uh, this business is there for you that is also wrong according to me then the student won't even try because huh. this this is not a easy journey right mindset has to be very very strong very strong so when you see my daddy himself saying if you are not getting you will do this business then he will give up there is a very high chance mm. so important is uh, don't worry if you pass or fail we are with you but you please give your best yeah so i should not hear from the teachers that my son is not giving best or my daughter is not giving best just if they tell your son is doing fine no worry then everything is fine if they have that mind okay that support system from the parents so then i think this uh, stress will not come because this stress or depression is not a human being right it is not a living thing it is just a thought creation and i believe everybody have stress like everybody will be happy everybody will be sad everybody be, might be in stress even i might be in stress somewhere but if i have some support system with me that stress will go yes so here that is the problem so that competition is very severe and that stress keep restricted to that particular student only so they end up taking this uh, very serious step yes which is not the fault of student i believe that so we that's have true. to actually it is a role of teacher and parent if parents are not able to counsel student at least they should go to some counselor or for example any student studying in our campus like modulus they should come to us sir uh, my son is working very hard but he is not getting marks can you please counsel him so automatic things become very very easy for example in our campus we have so many ways of checking this thing like uh, myself being a director i will go to the class right now i'm going to i have gone to every batch in my institute so i know the student may not be by name but i know i they have they know me every student know me by name and they know i teach maths and i i taught this chapter in their class so they are and even they are free to come to me any time and even same attitude is being followed by our teachers also that they are free to come to any teacher and express their views and as i say to students normally these things every student of my institute know i say to them i don't believe what your parents say i believe what you say for example we are running hostel also so if suppose parents will say food is not good actually i won't believe if student will say food is not good i will believe because student is eating Correct. not the parent so i will say to the student if you have any problem in your academics or non academic side without any hesitation you come to us will support you you sit with us uh, as a teacher i can judge the student because i know what is his attitude in the class so he cannot fake in front of me he can fake in front of teachers parents sorry parents because parents are not with him 
बट इज इन क्लास विद अस सो ही कैनॉट फेक इन फ्रंट ऑफ अ टीचर बट ही कैन फेक इन फ्रंट ऑफ द पेरेंट सो वी सिंपली वी शेड डू एवरी स्टूडेंट यू कम एंड स्पीक टू अस वी विल लिसन टू ट्राई टू हेल्प यू बट डोंट वरी एंड डोंट टारगेट मार्क्स टारगेट एफर्ट्स इफ यू आर जस्ट सर आई एम गिविंग माई बेस्ट दैट्स इट यू विल इम्प्रूव बिकॉज एवरीबडी इज नॉट ऑन द सेम प्लेटफॉर्म and there is no fixed plan to get a success right target is same but there are many paths many paths many many paths are there right so it is not mandatory that they have to follow what i followed my way of following like my path might be different from other student path or somebody not following my path may get better rank than me somebody was rank 1 also at my time right i am 359 so simple according to me there are many paths possible to get one aim but it should be with proper counseling from the teachers from the parents and proper support from the parents and if there is any problem parents should not try to become expert according to me it is again a hard statement to say if a parent is not into academics uh, into like into teaching line a parent don't know how to teach maths so he should not advise the student how to study maths rather than he should come and speak with a maths teacher and tell sir my kid is struggling can you please guide him to study maths so i think this advice parents also will good will do with a good heart only with a good wish for his son but according to me a teacher can do better and teacher can advise better in that particular field so that is very very important so i believe if these things are followed properly the stress won't exist unnecessary stress normal stress will be there will be there will it be is there. it is required it is required if, if, also if stress is not there <laughs> they won't study also over stress uh, over stress is uh, very very dangerous. very dangerous and picking the student at the right time identifying him that he is under stress because like some students are introvert yes. they can't express they don't express they don't express and uh, coming to like some students don't know how to speak telugu sorry english mm. like in this particular region how to speak telugu so they may hesitate to come to me so it is my duty to make them comfortable that okay you please come and speak to me or at least please come and speak to some teacher who know your language so but don't keep it in yourself only otherwise it will become difficult for him to handle it after one or two week or maybe after a month so it should not be keep on piling that uh, thought negative thought Correct. it should come out in front of someone uh, except friends because friends may not be able to help properly they are also of equal age if they help if they try to bring in front of some elder person maybe a uh, support from management or teachers or parents so well wisher maybe who is a mature person then that thought process uh, will become positive with some time and then he will start study correct so that is what i believe students have to give their best yes rather than focusing on the result yeah, and we have to make them give their best it yeah. is our role also it is uh, our, our means teachers and parents, parents. both they have to take their responsibility yes and and moving on to the next question uh, nitin ji yeah how to prepare for the je mains 2024 as uh, nta has uh, released the notifications okay. recently okay so now uh, coming to this question i think our subject team already came they have given subject wise yes yes na uh, important chapters Previous and episodes. important chapters and what how what are the strategies to be followed in uh, physics chemistry math so generally speaking first of all now i think uh, the first exam will be conducted in the month of january so now it is uh, i think uh, september, september is almost over september october november december we have 3 and 1/2 month mm. so in 3 and 1/2 month student cannot learn all things again from the basic level right because it's a two year syllabus so student cannot learn everything again so first of all self analysis is very important student should uh, sit with the teachers and understand where i stand right now how many chapters i have done properly and how many i can cover more first of all that is very important he should not be having see there is there are two things confident and over confidence yeah over confidence is like uh, sir i will get rank 1 mm. but i am not making efforts that is wrong second thing sir i will study in last one month i will get rank 1 that is also not going to happen in this exam mm. right so that is over confidence confidence is sir i will get a rank and i will work very very hard and you just guide me what to do so that is confidence so confidence is very very important strong mindset because uh, normally what happens in this j mains uh, exam like that is the first exam so i'll discuss about that if a student score 50 percentage marks uh, that exam is for 300 marks 100 maths 100 physics, physics 100 chemistry. chemistry so out of 300 if you score 150 marks he'll get a good nit for sure so they should not if a student uh, know my capability is not to score 
280, 270 to 250, he should not chase that target. He should know, okay, sir, I, I try for the next time because luckily now NTA gives two chances. Once in January, once in April. So, okay. if, so if they don't have that, uh, because that anal self analysis will tell them, let me target 170, 160 marks. And even like, uh, uh, I think our subject experts have spoken about the important chapters, which are very, very important. If they do those chapters, they'll end up getting 50 percentage marks in every subject. So if they plan strategically, strategically like I, I will do these chapters and I will not miss a question from these chapters, mm. then automatically that thing is uh, covered. They will end up getting 150, 160 marks. Scoring 220 marks is difficult in this exam. It need proper planning and it, it is not possible in last three months. Okay. The student should work hard consistently right from the beginning. throughout the year. Mm. But according to scoring 140, 150 mark is possible even now. If student is decently working hard, if he is not working at all, then it is impossible or maybe not impossible, difficult. Nothing is impossible actually, but difficult. But if he suppose if he is average student working decently hard, have done maybe 70, 60 percent syllabus, like whatever study material given by the educational institute, what, what, respective institute, if you have done 60 percent, 50 percent properly, I think in the last three months, if we plan these chapters, I should really need to focus properly and I am very positive, I will get something. Because here one more, uh, uh, maybe the mindset which student normally have, they end up getting nervous because exam is just three months away. So what they will say to parents, I don't want to prepare for January exam, I will target April exam. Because now NT has given, this national testing agency has mm. given two attempts as I told. Mm. So just to escape from the failure ah. and to uh, maybe bring themselves out of that nervousness, mm. they will say, I will target April one. I will skip this time. I, I will just give it for practice. Mm. And okay, that mindset is okay, but you give it for practice with full efforts. Yes. That is very important. What happens then they are April is far away, let me enjoy now. So that is very difficult. That should not be done. So you target April, you target January, because January targeting January is very, very important. Because after January, in the month of March, they will have board exams. They will have start having multiple exams, or even like uh, state level exams and other universities exams will be there in the month of April, May. So it will be difficult for them to prepare properly for ap uh, April attempt. January is only January, there is no bad exam. Still you have three months. If you like work very, very hard sincerely and strategically choose the chapters, these chapters I should choose from Physics, Chemistry, Math and follow that properly, 100% you can end up scoring 150, 160 marks. And once you score those marks in January attempt, so you know I'm getting one NIT. Right. So result will be there, I think, out by February second week or third week. So by February third week, you will you will know I'm getting one good college. So the confidence of the student will maybe rise to a very multiple fold. So then what happens? He'll get better performance or he'll maybe he'll get very good marks in April attempt also. Okay. At the same time, he will get good marks in other competitions also. And one more advice like here coming to this, they should write each and every exam. Many students, what they will do, they will write only mains. They will not write state level. According to me, you should write every exam, even if you don't want to join that institute. It will help you to understand your standing. And maybe we never know what may comes out to be better at the final when everything is done. You may decide, so you will have the options to decide. Correct. But if you do, if you write only one or two exam, then suppose you are not able to make it, then, then student uh, try, I will try one more year. But I, that thought should not come till you write your last exam. It is after the exams. Mm. Before that, you should give your best in each and every exam. So that will be my advice to the student. Don't get panic. Scoring 150, 160 marks is not a difficult at all in mm. J means January mm. attempt. Mm. Please choose the right topic, right chapter. Uh, if required, I can give you a PDF. Maybe, sir, you can attach that uh, with the program. We have given last five years J mains mm. like uh, what chapter contain how much weightage that complete everything is made properly so if they read it it will take maybe hardly 30 to 40 minutes to read for all three subjects and they choose the chapters like that they can score good marks great yeah great. and what are the other options apart from iit and nit because most of the parents many of the parents they make their students they make their kids to mm. study and focus on these two only, IIT and NIT. IIT, they chant okay. these two things only. Okay. What are the other options? Okay. See, there are many options, first of all. Mm. But uh, for, for the student who are preparing for IIT and IIT, uh, if they are in the preparation mode, 
I will tell them you keep only two options. Okay. These two options only. In your mind that I need to crack it. Okay. So that comes after that if you are not able to make it, what are different options? Mm. Because as I told you should target for the highest level, right? Even if you don't get it, there are multiple options. Like uh, other than IIT and IIT, there are state level exams are there. Where, uh, now I think in AP Telangana, there are very good uh, institutes uh, for graduations. And they're growing in the last five years, they have grown like anything. Then BITSET is one exam. Uh, that is also equivalent to IITs. So that is, they will, it's a private institute. They conduct their separate exam. Then even if you don't want to go for BTEC, there are science courses mm. in ISC Bangalore. That is also through JE Advanced, but that is a science course. Even if you don't want to do that, mm. you can do whatever you want to do. You are an MPG background student, you can go for LLB also, you can go for any course whichever you want to do. But those are basically easy to get. So that is why what I said initially, you should target IIT and IITs only. But if you are not able to make it, there are many many options available. So that, that feeling Haan. will reduce the stress. Will reduce the stress. That if IIT is not, if you are not able to make it to IIT, your life is not over. This is not the end of life. This is not the end of the life, but let me give my best for it. It should not be that there are multiple options available, so let me not try. Okay. That is wrong. Right? And if genuinely they feel I don't want to try, it's like genuinely they feel, it's okay. You step back, you dis discuss your family members, discuss with the teacher and then try I want to go for this particular exam. Mm. Many science courses are there, even statistics, ISI is there, triple IIT is there, mm. like that is also like into computer, very good career people are getting now, very good job offers also they're getting in computer field. So triple IIT Hyderabad is very, very famous and there are many triple IITs. So all these are there, so many options are there. Uh, except IIT and NIT. Okay, they should realize it. Yeah. And uh, coming to modulus, how different it is from the other coaching institutions? What parents or students can expect from modulus? Okay, so actually, normally different means uh, it, it is like um, uh, what what makes you so special? Okay. What are the infrastructure or faculty? Whatever it is. Okay, so thing. coming to like uh, this different part. Actually, we are doing our work honestly. That is what I normally wanted to say. Mm. And uh, if we do work honestly, obviously we will be different. So for example, coming to this counseling part. Mm. So students can directly approach me or any teacher without any hesitation. So that as I told counseling, see, every coaching center will have very good teachers. I will not deny that uh, only my coaching center have very good teachers. Every coaching center will have, but along with teaching, uh, very important part is uh, counseling. Mm. and comfortness of the student to speak to those teachers. Yeah. If I am a very good teacher but student is hesitating to come to me, then what use I am for that student? Right? Atmosphere. Atmosphere, right. So that is very, very important for me. And uh, even like for example, if I am taking the class, so what do we do normally? We call it prep workshops. So in that case, what we do? We like, suppose I am taking the class, I will be there in the class, they will be doing the work and I will be checking what are they doing. Normally what happens, uh, sometimes people recruit junior lecturers to take care of that thing. But in Modulus, we have the same teacher monitoring what they are doing and they can ask directly uh, doubts to us. That is second thing. Second thing is like we keep some surprise test also without telling student. And you tell them it is just for fun, just to understand if without preparation how much they can do. Because that is also very important. Like uh, sometimes see, because this as I told this path is unplanned, important is efforts. Right and uh, maybe proper counseling. So sometimes we keep some surprise test for the students and we tell them that uh, whatever you get, you try. So and students who are sincere students, in our institute, I think around 60% students are sincere, 60 to 70%. 30% we are trying to make them sincere. Okay. But uh, still we have not given up, but we'll try our best. Okay. So that even if they get at least something good college, they will get. And like speaking uh, about this uh, students who are not sincere, see how can we make them sincere? Just by giving proper counseling. For example, if you want to pursue a normal BTEC from a non IIT or non NIT college, let us take an example of some institute in Hyderabad. They are giving a BTEC courses, right? If you don't study, I think according to me, the fees right now is around five to six lakh complete expenditure, not only the fees, will be around five to six lakh per year mm. for this normal uh, institutes also. If you study for JE properly, you will get a free seat in that college. So it means you can save almost if it is a four year course, BTEC is a four year course, every it is around six to lakh, six to like five to six lakh. So total expenditure on student will be around six, four, twenty, around 30 lakhs total, including all. 
द स्टूडेंट कैन ब्रिंग दैट थर्टी लैक्स मे बी टू अराउंड टू एंड थ्री लैक्स जस्ट बाय पुटिंग डिसेंट हार्ड वर्क इफ इट इज नॉट अबाउट आई डी एन आई टी इट इज जस्ट अ नॉर्मल इंस्टीट्यूट सो दैट मच एक्सपेंडिज और दैट मच अमाउंट दे कैन सेव फॉर दैम सेल्फ एंड फॉर देर फैमिली मेम्बर्स जस्ट बाय स्टेइंग नॉर्मल नॉट लाइक वेरी एक्सट्रॉडनरी प्रिपरेशन नॉर्मल हार्ड वर्क फॉलोइंग द गाइडलाइंस वॉज अ टीचर इज सेइंग एंड डूइंग इट प्रोपरली फॉर सिक्सटी परसेंट नॉट इवन हंड्रेड परसेंट एफर्ट्स सो दैट ऑल्सो इज देयर सो वी टेल इट टू स्टूडेंट्स दोज यू डू वॉन्ट टू स्टडी बिकॉज आई थिंक अकॉर्डिंग टू मी आई कैन नॉट मेक एवरी स्टूडेंट ऑफ माई कॉलेज आई टी सो बट आई शुड मेक द स्टूडेंट फील दैट आई केम टू मॉडलस आई लर्न समथिंग एंड आई मेट अ बेटर प्लेस आफ्टर पासिंग आउट फ्रॉम हेयर सो दैट इज माई थॉट प्रोसेस सो फॉर दैट वी डू लाइक वी कीप सम वर्कशॉप फ्रॉम अदर मेंबर्स ऑल्सो लाइक मनी ऑफ माई फ्रेंड्स आर आई टीएंस एंड राइट नाउ सर्विंग द नेशन सम आर आई एस ऑफिसर्स आई पी एस ऑफिसर्स एंड सम आर इन टू लाइक एम बी ए दन एम बी ए फ्रॉम अदर कोर्सेज एंड सम आर इन यू एस सो दे विल कम एंड स्पीक टू द स्टूडेंट्स सो बिकॉज इफ आई कीप सेंग इफ आई कीप मोटिवेटिंग इफ ओनली वन पर्सन इज मोटिवेटिंग थ्रू आउट द इयर दे गेट बोल्ड बिकॉज ओनली नवनीतिन सर विल से आई मीन विल से सम मोटिवेटिंग वर्ड दे वॉन्ट लिसन टू मी बट इफ अ डिफरेंट पर्सनैलिटी इज कमिंग एंड स्पीकिंग दे विल लिसन ओके इफ द पर्सन ऑल्सो सेंग समथिंग ही केम फ्रॉम यू एस ओर इज लाइक आई एस और आई पी एस एंड ही सेंग सेम थिंग it means there might be there is some truth in that so they will have that thought process so if that thought process is there maybe some student will change and start putting efforts so that is what these small small things we plan these are like uh, maybe not very technical things but according to me very very important thing exactly. once a student is ready like as i told i don't believe uh, if parents say food is not good if a student say food is not good i immediately believe and take immediate action because if student want it properly he is won't be healthy And if he want to be healthy, he can't focus properly. But it is very important is understand the genuineness. So genuineness will come from student. Honesty. It's an innocent mind, and he will come and and I can easily read his mind because uh, I am also with him with in the same campus. So that is what and we connect more with them because now we are actually like their family. Maybe I am like their elder brother or maybe like father figure. So I feel in that way. So so that if they connect to us and if we give that sufficient way of learning till that level. then according to me the student can get success and without putting like uh, without undergoing under so much of stress that right. is what i feel right and coming to faculty faculty plays a crucial role <coughs> yes. in every student success yes, yes. right whether it is maths physics or chemistry any subject correct correct so while recruiting faculty uh, do you follow any particular criteria like qualification or any other things कर या एक्चुअली वी हैव अ रिगरस वे ऑफ रिक्रूटिंग फैकल्टी नॉर्मली फर्स्ट अ फैकल्टी हैव टू अंडर गो अ टेस्ट नॉर्मली एंड आफ्टर दैट ही विल बी अंडर ट्रेनिंग फॉर सम टाइम देन ही विल बी एक्सपोज टू द क्लास एंड आई बिलीव फैकल्टी ऑल्सो लाइक हेयर इन अवर कैंपस एज माई सेल्फ फ्रॉम आई टी डेली वी हैव लाइक ऑलमोस्ट सेवेंटी परसेंट टीचर्स एज आई टी एंस दे आर लाइक दम सेल्फ आई टी सो दे हैव क्रैक दिस एग्जाम एंड लाइक मे बी दे आर ऑल्सो पैशनेट लाइक मी and we have a team mix of youngsters and experienced people oh, great because uh, it's like not only youngsters are also not very bad and young experienced people need youngster also to upgrade so we have the dynamic team and we work as a team so it is not that if i am taking one batch it is not that uh, only it we it is my like responsibility it is a complete responsible complete mathematics department so we work as a team and as i told almost our 60% teachers are iitians mm. and we only take uh, that workshop where we clear doubts of the students and we only teach and we don't keep any jl uh, to take care of that thing uh, only he can rely completely on us on the teacher who's teaching in the class mm. and he can come and ask doubt to us and our strength batch strength i think we have a limited batch strength i think in one batch we don't take around 45 members we take roughly it may go like 40 uh, it may go till 48 49 also but uh, so that a teacher can have proper eye on the student and one more thing in coaching is like normally what is a school learning in school learning student like teacher will check the notes they will check the homework in coaching it is like bit difficult to do that because we have a limited time for example there are in my i am taking three batch let us assume so it means i am teaching around 150 135 students if i spend one minute on every day on one student my 135 minutes will be gone so i will not get proper time to teach so then i'll hurry up in teaching and i'll may miss some concepts so normally we have that we try to inculcate that uh, mindset in student also that you are doing for yourself don't do it to prove to others 
that don't try to prove others that uh, you are doing if suppose teacher is in the class or not in the class please work hard that is because uh, what i say to the student who are a hostel student staying in hostel is also hard work when you stay in hostel is also hard work then please make it it to the fullest don't just uh, stay in the hostel and do nothing because you are yourself doing a hard work so that is what i tell to student even in the class i tell see if you have the opportunity to go out and play you go out and play but since in the class you are sitting you don't have any other option to do what will you do so it's better to focus and study properly so that you can have a pro good sleep at the night time correct because student also if they don't work throughout the day they don't get good sleep they will feel that i am not working hard to, from tomorrow i'll start that thought will come and that thought will come every every day then again leading to depression but if they do okay now i can't do anything let me study then when time will come because in modulus also we give, we give them time to relax uh, we give them free time now you don't do don't touch books we give that time also so that time you enjoy talk to the friends and that is also very very important that circle so that is what normally we do this small small thing and our complete team is with us it is not the responsibility of only management like because management is not completely iits but people who have themselves clear iit and if they speak to the student they can understand the mindset in a much better way right and sometime we need to have to be strict also because counseling does not mean i should listen to the student and accept what he say that is not counseling sometime we have to be bit strict with the student also that this is wrong if you follow this process you will not get the result because counseling does not make to make him happy counseling means to make him successful and let him realize that Correct. that it is this step will help you to grow so sometime we have to be strict also so that proper thing according to me more than that management teachers like us who are from iit they can do it in a much better way correct so that one additional factor student will have so that is what normally that's about our team so that is what we do and like we are we doing it pretty well till now and i'm very satisfied with the team efforts which you have done till now great you are fortunate finally what would you like to say to the students who are preparing your suggestions or your tips anything okay so actually for students i will just say one thing uh, listen to everyone uh, carefully uh, listen to every relative carefully uh, but uh, don't do what everybody say uh, you see what uh, like uh, do what you really wanted to do uh, maybe your mind will change your mind is not stable at your age it will change but uh, once you planned like if suppose after 11th after 10th if you are planning that uh, i want to go for it preparation it is a difficult process but once you have decided please don't give up in the middle even if you feel you are a failure it's work hard and fail rather than give up giving up in the middle yes. a stress is nothing it is just your thought process right so simply you please work hard and fail rather than give up, giving up in the middle don't give up don't give up in the middle don't give up uh, in the middle so for example if suppose students who are in 10th right now if they want to prepare for iit then they will start i think they from june 23 if they are into that field then before that if they don't want to prepare they can come out it's not mandatory as i told but once they are into it then till 2026 may they should be trying for that only then automatically there is very high chance of getting success somewhere if not into iit mm. so that is what i'll tell to students and please be positive and uh, sometime we tell you some things uh, just for your good for example we tell student don't overuse mobile right because this covid has made everyone addicted to mobile even but i tell to them so simply what they will say sir but you are also using but simply i say now i am not going to write any exam you are going to write exam so when you come to my age you also use right but right now it is your like time of struggle so you please listen when i was like you we were not even we were fortunate that we don't have mobile also <laughs> that time and still we are able to clear iit yes. so mobile will not help you to clear iit because this exam is i think from last 60 70 years your conduct their government is conducting this exam and people are able to clear it from the day one without using any resources just right. by hard work so that is what i would like to say don't believe that one mobile application will help you to achieve this exam definitely if you work hard with teachers in front of you that is going to give you better output so trust your teachers and listen to them and work hard and you will enjoy the process same thing uh, we would like to tell to parents also please don't push your son or daughter to go for this exam counsel them if it is your dream 
for your son or daughter to study, make him study in IIT, it's very good dream actually. But please counsel him or her rather than forcing him or her. Forcing will not give because if a parent want, I want my son to go to IIT, it is not possible. If I want my son should go to IIT, I cannot make him go to IIT. Only if I counsel him and try to explain him what is the advantage and why you should go, right? Maybe if he realize that, yeah, yeah, my dad is saying right or my father is saying right, my mother is saying right and I let me try and even if I fail, they are not going to punish me but let me give my best. So if that mindset is there, then automatically there is very high chance of getting into good college. Good college. So that is what I would like to say to parents. So I understand the emotions of parents even like what are the emotions they have but according to me that emotion should not become dominant over the your son correct right because ultimately he is your son or he is uh, she is your daughter so she should not suffer because of that emotion be like a support system to her or him and help him or help her to progress correct so if that mindset is there i am not saying leave them free that is also not right Le don't leave them free but monitor in such a way that students should fail or that um, if I have this problem, let me discuss with my mother or father. They should not hesitate, should I discuss with my mother or father. If that discussion, if that doubt is there, if I go to my father, if I say, because at this age, movie fact is too much at that age. Correct. And uh, luckily, like they get some free time. So normally speaking lightly, some students, what they will say, I want to marry this girl or a girl want to, I want to marry this boy. So if they have that thought, they should have that comfort level to speak to the parent or teacher Correct. rather than speaking to the friends. friends. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, hey, it's very nice, very nice. So they start distraction and that is also one of the reason of going to depression. Correct. So simply that comfort level we have to give to the student. If we give that much comfort, we can counsel them because that feeling is not wrong to be correct speaking spe speaking properly but the time is wrong right so we have to counsel them in a proper way and if we counsel them 100 percent they will come out of it and they will do better in their life so that is exactly. what i would like to say to parents also exactly Nidhin Garu, thank you so much for joining us and for coming to our studio and explaining all the you know uh, tips suggestions to our viewers and the students who are preparing for this iit or nit whatever it is Thank you so much for joining us. Uh, thank you so much, Raju Garu. I'm sure it is an eye-opener for uh, the students and the parents as well. This so let us hope so. <laughs> and uh, thank you so much for inviting me. And uh, I'm very happy to come here again. And uh, thank you so much. Jai Hind. Thank you. This is the Ivalti episode of Dikshuchi Karikrama. In this episode, we will talk about the first episode. We will talk about the first episode. We will talk about the subject. Maths, gaochu, physics, gaochu, chemistry, gaochu, like the overall ga, uh, preparation of the subject. In this episode, we will talk about the overall ga, e subject. We will talk about the best and best. 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 We will talk about the best and best.